Since the gasoline-powered internal combustion engine that runs today's cars and trucks was first invented 105 years ago, there have been incremental improvements. But the basic combustion process has remained the same. A spark ignites a gas and air mixture in the cylinder. A flame consumes the mixture, and the heat generated pushes a piston which rotates a crankshaft that turns a car's wheels. For decades, engineers have worked to improve the efficiency and reduce emissions without dramatically increasing cost. A theory about changing the combustion process of the gasoline engine, enabling a dramatic step forward in efficiency, has been debated for many years, but never practically proven until now. Homogeneous Charge Compression Ignition, or HCCI, has finally been demonstrated in practical use. In an HCCI engine, we burn the fuel much more efficient by having a flameless combustion in the combustion chamber that's not triggered by a spark plug. So we run more efficient and create less toxic emissions in the engine. Combustion is achieved by compressing fresh air and gas with leftover exhaust, meaning less exhaust escapes. And because there's no need for a spark, gas is burned at a lower temperature, making the engine up to 15% more fuel efficient. If you look at a conventional gasoline engine, it looks like it has maybe 20 to 25% potential for improvement. And looking at things like this homogeneous charge compression ignition, for example, makes a, a pretty good step there. Now, of course, hybrid gas electric engines, which came to market nearly a decade ago, pushed fuel economy up dramatically. So why is this important? People think, boy, there's hybrids out there, there's fuel cells. Why are we talking about gasoline engines? Well, don't forget, every hybrid has an internal combustion engine. Most of them will be gasoline powered because it's cheaper to build a gasoline engine than it is a diesel. To, to, pair it with a hybrid drivetrain. HCCI gives the gasoline engine maybe 15 percent more fuel efficiency than the existing gasoline engine, which is really a good thing. General Motors, who showed off the HCCI at its proving grounds in Michigan, says it's a big step toward reducing our dependence on foreign sources of oil and hopes to have a production model ready sometime in the future. I'm Chris Hansen.